This project is representative of a project that second year students do as part of their project course. So all students are put into teams and they're given a, a project they have to, to work on as a group. Uh, this is a robotic project uh, where they have to get a robot to follow a magnetic field that is created. The most important parts I want to point out in this robot are two coils here on the front, obviously the wheels here on the side, and there's a microprocessor right here that acts as the brain for the robot. If there's a magnetic field underneath the robot, it's able to, uh, it generates a current through these two coils on the left and right side. The microcontroller is able to read how much current is going through each coil and tell whether the magnetic field is stronger in the left or the right coil. And then it controls these two wheels uh, in order to turn the robot towards the direction that the magnetic field is, is moving in. So if I put it down here and turn it on, and turn on this power supply, there's a wire underneath this board and this function generator provides an alternating current that creates a magnetic field that the coils are then able to detect. So this robot will travel around on the pattern following the wire that's underneath the board and it will continue to do so. Uh, well, similar technology to this will get used for the high-speed magnetic trains that you find uh, throughout the world. Um, really, it's a good project to integrate the different aspects of electrical and computer engineering into uh, an introductory level project that students are able to work together on.